As far as like uh, corporate personhood, uh, if you were elected, would you vote to uh, abolish that? Well, here's what or I would do, because I think you're talking about Citizen the United. Citizens United. Yeah. You know, I think history's going to show that that was the worst Supreme Court decision, probably since Dred Scott, mm -hmm. um, past hundred years anyway. And what I would do is introduce a constitutional amendment to say that a corporation can't be a person. Okay. Um, and I would um, do this. I would, of course, fight to get Supreme Court justices on the bench that would hopefully overturn Citizens United. Mm -hmm. um, but I would also pass comprehensive campaign finance reform, like I helped do in Connecticut, okay. so that you would uh, collect a lot of small individual contributions. Mm -hmm. And then, um, once you showed that you had a lot of small contributions to show credibility, everybody gets the same amount. That's how you know the governor was mm -hmm. able to run on the Democratic side. That's how legislators run here. Okay. I would co-sign that same legislation in Washington. All right. All right. Um, another quick question. Yes? Uh, what are your feelings on term limits? You know, I have to say that when I was in the legislature, I always um, would say that there are term limits every two years because the voters mm. would have the opportunity. Yeah. But I have to say, now that I, I have been watching mm. the dysfunction in Congress, mm. I reassessed my uh, opinion. It makes okay. me think, hey, wait a minute, maybe I should think about that. Yeah. Because clearly, uh, they're not getting the job done. And, you know, here we are at a, what, 12% favorability level. Mm -hmm. I mean, it is at historic lows. Yeah. But I think that it's really important that we focus on getting rid of uh, the Wall Street influence and the corporate special interests. And the way to do that mm -hmm. is to sideline the lobbyists and say, hey, lobbyists, you can't contribute. You can't give gifts. Mm -hmm. You know? And by the way, what are politicians doing drawing their own districts? Yeah. So. Um, that ties into my next question, yes. actually. Uh, <clears throat> would you vote to reinstate Glass-Steagall? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. In a heartbeat. Excellent. Let me add it. Can't um, wait to go work with Elizabeth Warren. Yeah. You know, those Republican senators and Congress people didn't want her to be the head of the financial, Consumer Financial Board because mm -hmm. they knew that she would be out there really fighting for uh, consumers. And, you know, it's important to make that uh, a priority. Excellent. Can't wait to go work with her. Um, her from Massachusetts and me from Connecticut. The bill, H.R. 347, are you familiar with that? Which, which one is that? That's the one where they made it uh, illegal to protest outside anywhere there's a, a, uh, an event where someone's being protected by the Secret Service. Oh, uh, that... Just passed I, a couple days ago. That you have to be really careful because while I understand, um, you know, issues around, say, Gabby Giffords mm -hmm. getting shot, at the same time, one of the fundamental tenets of our Constitution is that everyone has the right to free speech, and that means in a public place, be able to uh, say what they think. Yeah. And so, uh, and that is protected by the Constitution, so we have to make sure we're not stepping on that constitutional right. right. Uh, one last question. Yep. Would you um, vote to end congressional pensions and, and health care? Um, uh, beyond the point of being in office, uh, the pensions to me. So, um, okay, um, you mean so that you don't get a pension if you're in Congress? Yeah, if you do your like time you, in Congress. You do your time in Congress and then nobody gets a pension. Yeah. I'd be okay with that, but you know what's even better? How about if you don't pass the budget, mm. uh, you don't get paid? Okay. We send people to Washington to do their work and then they're doing it. How about that? All right, excellent. Thank you very much. Day, 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 yes, it's a love.